who doesn't love fried rice? Because that's something that we can all enjoy. It's a tasty dish, it has all your veggies, your meat, and also your rice for the carbs. But today, we're gonna make something that's inspired by an anime. One of my favorite animes, it's called Food Wars, or I know in Japanese as Shokugeki no Soma. So, Shokugeki no Soma inspired me to make a dish that can customize fried rice, be sweet and tasty, and also add a kick of spice to it. And that dish is pineapple curry fried rice. So that is what we're gonna make today. My name is Tarek. I enjoy cooking I, because I'm really into fitness. I am a fitness trainer. So I'm gonna show you how to make pineapple curry fried rice. So let's get cooking. Show cooking. So we start off with cutting up the pineapple. First we cut it up, we preserve the stem because we're gonna use that for presentation later. So we cut the pineapple in halves. And then we scoop up the pineapple inside, scoop it into a bowl. And we get preserved that for later. We're also gonna keep the shell, the outer part, because we're gonna use that for some special occasion later. We're gonna customize it a bit. So first, we started with boiling our, our shrimp, because for the meat, we're gonna actually use seafood. So first, we're gonna bring water to a boil, boil our shrimp, cook that for a bit, once the shrimp comes into a boil, we let that sit there for a slight bit, a couple of minutes so it can boil. Not too long because we don't overcook it because we're gonna put everything together. Then after that, we're gonna add the fish balls, which we did cut up so we can portion it out. Let that boil for a bit so it can soften up and get nice and tender. After that, we add the mixed veggies. There's our peas, carrots, and corn. After that, we're gonna mix that around, but let the veggies cook up, soften up. And then, when that's all ready, we're gonna add in the rice, the carbs. Because who does not love carbs? Who does not love carbs? So after that, we're gonna mix it around. That all mixed together, all even out. Then we're gonna add in the turmeric to give it its nice color and a kick of spice into it. And then for sweetness, we're gonna add in our signature pineapple. Gives a juicy taste. We're gonna add that in, mix it around, let the taste spread out. Then we're gonna add in our curry powder. That is, so the curry powder is our spice for it, to give it a nice kick. Mix that around, got this nice golden color, nice golden yellow color. So after we scoop in the pineapple fried rice into the pineapple shell that we preserved, we're gonna put it into our preheated oven of 350 degrees Fahrenheit. We're gonna let it cook there for about 15 minutes. After we take it out, have a nice look, and voila, we have our pineapple curry fried rice. We baked it because we want the juice from the shell to add the taste, and sweetness to the rice. So now it's nice and juicy and a bit sticky. And that's how we make our version of Shokugeki no Soma, or otherwise known as Food Wars pineapple curry fried rice. It's a bit of a process because we're trying to be creative and being artistic with it, but it is quite easy to prepare if you just want to make pineapple fried rice or curry fried rice. Just 
just the curry powder to add a kick of spice to it. I hope you like the video. Comment below, let me know what you think of this recipe. Make sure you like and share the video because we will be making videos like these often. And make sure you subscribe because I make videos like these often about cooking and fitness and also mindset. And I'll see you in the next video.